Hear me, I said I'm on a Niger boy representing for King Mix Up, the number one source for the latest in dancehall entertainment. Yeah, yeah! Boom, viewers, welcome back to the channel, subscribers, and I don't know the thing said, bless. Hoping I have a wonderful day today, but you know my thing already, one bag of one in the one, I gotta give you them daily updates from the people on the sea and don't see on the screen. That's why it's extremely important to watch to the end, and with that being said, let's talk about the latest episode on Love and Hip Hop, because it seems to be getting under some people's skins. At least that's how it seems to me because Spice is addressing a couple of people, um, I guess, talking stuff about, you know, her kids being in Jamaica um, while she lives in America. And I guess, you know, her mother taking care of, um, you know, her kids is a problem, too. I am just so many, you know, what I mean, but before we get into that, people was asking what up with Carly Red because obviously them say everybody in Spice Yard, but not she. So them ask if Carly and her are still friends, and this is what she had to say. No, we are not. Okay? No, we are not. No, we're not. And to wake up to make sure, you know, I wake up in my bed. And so I feel like it's a process. But... I'm still at a better place and that we give God thanks for. So if somebody says, how are you mentally? That's, that's a very important question because sometimes we need to check up on our friends and make sure everybody is mentally okay. Um, I think I share my story. Everybody know when we go through. And so it wasn't, it's not easy. Um, and I feel like one of my biggest fears in life is death. Um, and I have my two kids, you know, I just live in a life like, oh my God, I really can't trust, you know? I mean, that's a hard question. I don't want to get sad over it, but thank you for asking if I'm mentally okay. I'm at a better place. That's what I will say. I'm at a much better place than I was last year. I'm doing much better. I'm very, very, very grateful to be alive. Very grateful to just be here with friends and celebrating us being on MTV together. Um, because the truth is, I could have not be here. And I don't take that lightly. And that's why I'm always a big up God and I give him all the glory. Despite what anybody else might think and what they want to say. I just have to do, you know, my testimony. Which is giving God in glory. When bring me through. Trust me. It's not easy. But I'm, I'm, at, I'm at a better place mentally. So thank you for asking that question. Yeah, so obviously they're still friends, you know what I mean? Because they're following each other still on um, <laughs> on Instagram, you feel me? Um, I'm not sure where Carly is at. She's probably doing something what she's doing wherever she's at, you feel me? Um, so put in the comment section what you think about that, what Spice said about the friends, something. You think she was just being sarcastic because, you know, I guess people... Um, was asking, you know, she don't want to tell them our business. I don't know, you know what I mean? But nevertheless, the show on Love and Hip Hop, you know, featured her children and, you know, Spice, you know, just coming from surgery and all of these things, as you can see, her mother is there to give um, assistance. But um, for some reason, people find issue with it. So Spice um, was addressing it right here. So let's take a listen and then we'll proceed to see what I'll go on for not to go on. I want to pin this comment real quick. How do I move my face from right here? How me can I move my face so, I, so they can read this comment? I want to move my picture. This the live. Oh, uh, pants. How they going to read it? Anyway. Yeah, I can't move. The comment, this person, not underscore, aka underscore lips. She was basically coming for me saying, oh, boy, they have ever excuse in the world why they don't have their children and celebrities do that all the time i'm gonna want to address it real quick and talk about this you see me me a one woman me not play with my two kids them i've been a single mother my son is 15 years old so i've been a single mother for 15 years and i did that on my own no child support never asked a man for your child support i never did it I'm gracefully do it for my own. I'm going to give God thanks that I was able to be blessed and put in a one position so I could do it for my own without a fear fight for a man Give me anything. So I'm so grateful to God for that. And I did that without complaining. What you're not going to do, I make it seem like I don't want to be with my kids. My kids being in Jamaica with my mom is for my sanity. Me not having them here, meanwhile I have to tour to 
feed for them by myself, that's my sanity right there. But tell me, say, they rape my daughter. I'm mean, gonna go carry my pick me them. I'm gonna live with nobody. I'm gonna go give me the explanation. So I'm gonna rape my daughter. I'm gonna rape my. I'm gonna finger my, 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 my boy. I'm gonna do nothing. I'm gonna drive me crazy. Hold on one second. Okay. Yeah. So, when you not talk, but me and my people, they want to talk straight on the talk facts. Because you know, I understand. My Caribbean audience and my Jamaica audience, they understand when they come on to my kids. People wait up for Christmas when they come on to my people, because 100% of me are buying for two people. I'm going to ask you, I'm going to ask Christ. People know how I take care of my kids. But I get to understand that a lot of people, a lot of audience, or a lot of people who don't really know much about, you know, maybe me or my brand or what me encourage. I don't like to jump and make comments. Not talking to people business when you don't know. When you get on the facts straight. When you get on the facts and the pride straight. When you come on to my two people them. And me one and God and them. And me go all out and me sacrifice. This is my second home in Atlanta. My son cried when I gave him the keys to this house. Me not come here for joke. Me not come here for skin teeth. Me not fucky fucky. Me not come here for tech man. Me come here for work for myself. And do this for me and my people them. And I me the pan and that are my focus. So the body feel like say, me I go have my kids them in Atlanta and some of them look at strangers I go come and look after me pick me and call me and tell me say, this happened, that happened to them. And no now no now go come finger my daughter. So leave me alone with my kids them I know exactly what I'm doing, what I'm, what I'm about. I'm a damn good mom and I don't need validation from nobody. I don't play about my two picnic them. You know where the America picnic me in kids. I don't play about my kids. I love them to death and they are well taken care of. When I say my kids are well taken care of, not one, both. Okay? I have a son and a daughter and they are well taken care of. Taken care of more than me. This is Spice TV Tuesdays. I wanted to clear up that comment real quick. Somebody said drink water, Grace. What time I call a phone? Can't tell me if I calm down here and drink water. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Somebody say better speak in a tongue. <laughs> yeah, I don't mean I run that joke there when they come on to my picnic them and my kids them. So that clear up right there. So when you see me on TV and you see me on Love and Hip Hop and I say, um, when you see me I separate from my kids, them is for a reason. My mother, when me have her, she has my sanity. If Nicholas is spinning at the house, she'll call me and say, Gracie, you don't know if Nicholas is spinning at the house. If Ty is stepping at the house, she'll call me and say, Ty is stepping at the house. I refuse to let strangers watch my and others or have to hire people to take care of them kids to each his own everybody is different i'm personally telling you that i trust my sister big up Fenice as well who takes care of my kids i trust my sister and i trust my mother so it gives me sanity because as a single mother i have to work very extremely hard two times as hard three times as hard to provide for my two kids by myself and my sanity comes from knowing, say, my mother and my sister are watch over my children. Okay? So just for calm down and speak in a proper English so my American audience can understand, that's where me get my sanity from. Now let me kids them with no stranger. I just the truth, yeah. Spice daughter 16, big up yourself. Yeah, talk the truth, I just the truth and I just the facts. You know how much things these young kids go through when we leave them with strangers and leave them with nanny and leave them with uncle and leave them with this person and leave them with that person you have any idea the amount of story when we hear from people you have any idea what these kids go through when you leave them with people i refuse to leave my kids with someone that i don't trust or i don't know and again i'm not bashing anybody because as mothers we have to make sacrifice and we have to work and we have to go out there and get things done and some people are not don't have the privilege you know of leaving their children with a mom or whatever and to each his own but i'm saying why my mom is alive and why my sister Fenice is there me i gonna leave them with people with me trust
and it's just what it is. So let's just clear that up real quick. When you see me and my pin them, when you comment and come talk about say, oh celebrity love talk about them mother have them kids. And she have them. Cause my mother not feel good by pin them. She not rape them. Yeah. Right there so. So next question, we're gonna eat real quick and share out a plate and then we can get in at the next question and, and I'll put up the next comment because we're gonna get in at everything. Because we're not in my business. So let me just get some food real quick. Can I look from when we forget a plate. Yeah, almost yeah, there. I think so. Ice Spice, I agree with you from St. Vincent. Thank you so much. Boss Lady says, same so. Thank you. Tracy and say, I can relate. Somebody said, big up Auntie Fenice. Yeah, big up my sister Fenice. Yeah, somebody said, oh, your trust hurt them. And that is also true because sometimes when I listen to the people, them story, sometimes I them uncle, sometimes I them auntie, sometimes I the same family them. But I trust my mother. I love her. I trust my sister Fenice. I'm a campaign, everything when my have said they will never hurt my kids. And it is what it is, like I said. But so their facts are speaking, bestie. I'm just gonna come. I'm gonna tell dad. Yeah, so that's what um, she was addressing that she's a good mother and all of this stuff and things and things. Um, the only person that says spice. Um, you know, is I don't want to say not a good mother, but the only one that hinted that Spice have issues towards kids is her baby father, Nicholas. You know what I mean? But besides that, we see that Spice uh, takes care of everything for her children, X, Y, and Z. Anyway, people may not go along this out no longer because we have another update to um, do on the Credible Boss channel. You see me? So make sure and go over there, sir. And subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified when we do drop the latest and dance on news, musical reviews, and gossips. Bless.